Okay, guys, just want to take a moment to explain you how to uh, install a um, natural gas to propane conversion kit on a furnace. It's a bit confusing, so I just decided to take a video to make it easier for some guys out there that are going to do this. Uh, first thing that we're going to do, there are some little orifices up here. I don't know if you can see them here in the uh, video, but anyways, we have to take this manifold out, open those with the adjustable wrench and put the new ones for the propane in, which is very easy. The second thing that we're going to do, if you see this little uh, kind of brass screws here that I put in into the venture tube. So those are called mixing screws or mixer screws what, or something like that. So we have to just take the, uh, the whole venture tubes out. Uh, there's a little dimple on the, underneath on the venture tube. We have to make a little hole with a drill bit that comes with the conversion kit and then screw the screws in all the way. So the head of the screw can come flush with the venture tube, that, I mean the top of the venture tube. Next thing, we are going to open the these two brass screws for the low and high heat. We open them. There is another little plastic screws to adjust the gas pressure. We also take them out. And there are two springs inside. We have to replace those springs with the propane spring that still comes with the kit. For the low heat, we have to turn the screw in nine and a half turn. And uh, for the high, we have to do it 13 and a half turn. And then we just put everything back. Uh, the last part of it is to install this uh, low, uh, low gas pressure switch. Technically, that's what it's called. Uh, this is the way that you install it. The, the, this little brass uh, elbow that comes with it goes underneath where the inlet of the gas pressure, when you, wherever you want to connect your manometer. It's like the, I mean, this screw used to be here. So we take it out, we install this assembly here, and this is the, uh, the low gas pressure switch. And there are two connections on top here, if you see. These two orange wires comes with it. So you have to wire this in series with the low heat gas pressure, I mean with the low heat pressure switch that says uh, LPS on it, low pressure switch. So there is a, this, this orange wire, it used to be connected here. So we disconnect this orange wire from the low pressure switch, I mean low heat pressure switch. And then from this low gas pressure switch, one of the orange wires comes and gets connected on this this one here, and the other one will be connected on the wire that used to be installed here. So it's kind of wired in series. Uh, and uh, once you do this, that's it. That's all about it. I hope this video can help some people out there.